Hi guys, Shannon here with Chattanooga Fashion Expo, continuing our alumni series with Damian Kyle. Hi, Damien. Hello, 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 everybody. <laughs> um, so you guys are probably not new to Damien, but if you are, we're going to back up to CFE 2021, our very first show when Damien showed up and he had never been on a runway. Never seen one, touched one, been near one, never. It's pretty wild. I know. And this man um, tore it up, and it's so hard that the judges could not make a decision between him and mine. They're like, we have to award two awards to our oh models. Gosh. And both of you guys had never modeled before on a runway. No. Incredible. Tell us how that was for you. It was, between them, uh, it was, it was fun. You know, it was different. It was a different experience. Um, I never thought I'd be on a runway, let alone, like, walking in multiple shows. I'd really only went to do one designer and ended up doing three. <laughs> and so it, it, the whole day was just like backstage, just pandemonium, it was wild. I was nervous, scared, crying. <laughs> Thank God for tequila. Um, <laughs> yeah, it was, it was, a, it was a, an, an amazing experience, but it was definitely a challenge and a push, but I, I loved every second of it. Yeah, and here's, here's what's cool though, and I, when you can speak to this, Damien, because mm -hmm. the reason Damien is good on a runway, I think, is because Damien is a dancer and a choreographer. When you have a control of your body, when mm -hmm. you understand how to move your body, it's probably much easier to become good at working right. in front of a camera or working a runway, mm -hmm. showing clothes, things like that. Talk about that a little bit, because that's your specialty. You yeah. are a specialty in movement. Mm -hmm. Your specialty is movement. I think for me, I think in rhythmic patterns, so when I'm able to do things that allows me to like think in like a rhythmic pattern it makes me more comfortable i'm able to do it a little mm -hmm. better mm -hmm. um i think on a runway i kind of have to become a different person and that's nice being able to like separate damien everyday damien from like damien the model or damien the performer or like the mm -hmm. artist and so i think that's kind of my my process my my journey is kind of how i am able to like be really shy and introverted which people don't know well, if you know you know but i'm yeah. super shy very introverted i'm always in the house but if you see me in like a performative aspect, I'm mm -hmm. very different. And I think Damien, that different person- you're not shy when you perform. No, I, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not shy, which is really there's strange. There's shy and then there's Damien. <laughs> yes. When he performs, they are not the same thing. No, you are fire when you perform. Like any time oh, I've ever seen you take a stage, thank you man, so you much. take it. And I, thank you. it's what I love about you because Damien brings like full passion, full energy, um, and a very high level of work. Thank you so much. You always have. Um, and I mean, so even his first time on the runway, he won. Um, and then since then, your career has just continued yeah, to be awesome. It, so tell me yeah. about, he's a dancer, an incredible dancer, choreographer, and producer. Mm -hmm. So tell me a little bit about your journey from CFA and maybe how it helped you to get to where you are now. I don't, I've always been like told like, hey, you should do this. You should try this. But like, I think once people actually saw me do it, CFE kind of like was like the catapulting of like my official modeling quote unquote career. Mm -hmm. um, I've, I think that because I like to do so many different things, and I love a challenge. I never tell myself I can't do something or someone yeah. can't tell me I can't do it because I'm just going to end up doing it. Yeah. And so I love a challenge, but also just seeing how models actually work and how it works to be a model. I kind of figured like, hey, I want to create a direct. I want to like do branding. I want to do my own line at some point. I want to create my own shows. I think seeing CFE was like, okay, I can do it because I've done it. Yeah. And so, yeah, that was kind of, I've done so many hundreds of runway shows, it feels like, and photo You've done shoots. A lot. Yeah, You've it's done been a lot. a lot. And that's one of the things we've been talking about with each person is like, what was cool is like Chattanooga was kind of disconnected 1, when we started CFE. Yeah. And then CFE kind of brought everybody together and that's one of the things we did. We created a platform, but we also created connections that weren't mm -hmm. there before. And those connections have sustained. It's beautiful right. yeah. watching everybody continue to work with each other, grow, support mm -hmm. each other. And to me, that's what creates a very strong independent market in a region right. is when people start to work together. Because now we're three years in. Mm -hmm. Imagine when we're five years in right, and we're all right. working in different cities and now we have the ability to give each other opportunity exactly. to say, hey, I'm working on this thing in LA, come, mm -hmm. come work. Right. So that's what I've always hoped that we could build here. And that's what I see happening is we're becoming what I hoped in the beginning is the next Austin, the next, mm -hmm. you know, city that has all these different art forms yeah. that work together and mm -hmm. a group of creatives that are really striving to get to a higher level and move into regional, national and international markets. Right. And you're part of that. And I like Damien's work ethic is impeccable i've i've used him for multiple things and i, I tell him all the time like i would use you for anything anytime anywhere his that. work Thank ethic so his much. integrity his level of excellence and professionalism is just it's it's 
beyond. And I, I'm so proud of you for Thank that you because so some much. people have talent, but they don't have professionalism or they don't have the work ethic or whatever to go with it. You mm -hmm. have all of them, Damien, Thank and you. you've always been a star. I knew it from the minute I laid eyes on you. Oh my gosh. Thank and you've you. proven it by what you've done. And I'm, I'm just so, so proud of you. I can't wait to get even bigger opportunities. But um, this year we're really excited because we're adding on something we haven't had before, which is a creative director for our show. So we always kind of allow the, de the designers to kind of work with our model coordinators and just figure it out right um with uh, tracy came one year gave some input and then last year she got covid so mm -hmm. then it was just like designers working with naya but this year we decided to add the extra step of adding a creative director which is you know damien to step in between to talk to the designers ahead mm -hmm. of time and to really cu curate and create a show that's special mm -hmm. and so that each of the segments of this show this show is going to be a little different this year we're not going to do like kind of a traditional raised runway we're going to do some different things and i thought having someone who is a movement specialist who understands fashion who understands bodies and how to move those bodies um if we give you a nice stable of people and then some really good design mm -hmm. i think you're going to do some magic and i can't wait I to cannot see what you wait for y'all to see it you know it's going to be a really intricate different kind of show but i think it's going to be impactful and powerful and unforgettable and like a moment i really like want to create a yeah. big moment because it can get a little saturated with a bunch of different shows right. and designers doing this and doing that but i really want to create like a unforgettable like statement making like movement and moment with the show so i'm excited yeah and we got national press last year which right. i'm really proud of and i actually had a call with the owner of that whole magazine this week and he's saying they're going to give it to us again so that's really exciting Can't because I, I love the fact that our local and regional artists mm -hmm. are getting these opportunities to step up in magazines that are in new york and mm -hmm. la and you know real markets miami um and i want us to be a real market you know what i mean we, like yeah, we're we... continuing to get better and better mm -hmm. like there's no reason now that we can't start exactly to um, and some of our designers, like we were just talking with Jimmy, you know, some of our designers, their stuff may not always go here. They need a market mm -hmm. that understands it. They exactly. need to be in a market that understands hot right. and can pay the price for it. Exactly. You know, the work that goes into those things. So I'm really excited to see everybody expanding and yeah, just to too. see what you bring to the table this year. But thank so you for always being here for everything you, and just showing up 110% always. Thank you. Saving so the day a couple times. And I don't just, know how not to. It's like I can't just do you, one thing. I'm always an all hands on deck right? kind of guy. Like whatever needs to get done, I'm going to get it done. It's like we're producers our, names our are hardest right. producers yeah. that's why like our, we'll do everything to right. make sure it works it has to work and i love that so if you need any kind of a producer this is your man choreographer Call me. model <laughs> dancer i don't know if you need a cake made he could probably make yeah. you a really good cake or know someone that does or know someone say, that does it. i'll never admit to not making a cake <laughs> i'll never admit that <laughs> I'll be your taste tester yes. if you make a cake. Um, but anyway, um, thank you, Damien. Thank you and we so look much. forward to see how you help stir it up this year. We're going to have a great, mm. great time. Prepare. So yeah. everybody get ready. Shake up the world Damien, this time. Damien, Kyle, and friends. Yes, and that friends. They're going to hit the and runway. Thank you. And thank you, Shannon. Like, you yeah. came here and like really shook up the market and really like put a fire on people's asses. Like, no, like I'm here. I'm doing something that's not being done. So thank you for that yeah. because it, it, it needed to be someone that wasn't already here. Yeah, and, and hopefully think, we'll yeah. curate, continue to curate what we've always done, which is education, networking, and platform opportunities mm -hmm. that are a little different than what the individual designers can do. They right. have to focus on their line, exactly. but I want to focus on raising out everybody. That's mm -hmm. what we're trying to do is elevate, create a virtual runway to take people from Chattanooga to the region, to the country, to the world. And that's, that's what possible. we're building together. Living Testament. Yeah, that's what possible. we do, building together. You know, mm -hmm. that's what it's all about. So. Yeah. Thank you, Damien. Thank you so much. I love you. Thank you. Love you more. Shanna Forstall with Chattanooga Fashion Expo, our alumni series. One more incredible alumni from CFE. We'll see you this year, everybody. Bye. Bye, everyone.